Ooh. Okay. So yeah, this was uh, actually one which um, I disabled my mic for and didn't even realize I'm on. So look at me there, talking away. Just chatting. Just chatting away. A little bit annoying, isn't it? But, I mean, what can I do? I was pretty much just complaining like, oh, look at this. Which view professional is the first time I'm doing this? And I hope it's okay because this is my nemesis house. And just kind of explain what we're doing. So it's a case of I'll try and find the bits and bobs, um, but I won't mention what they are. If you can spot them in the stream, um, note it down in the link below. Um, and yeah, we should be able to figure it out this goes together. Um, so let's just get in. Got to wait for it to load. I'm happy they're chilling. My nice navy jumper. That's a nice jumper on me. I'm looking good. Right. So we got the thermometer and we got the book as we usually do with the strong flashlight and we've got the key waiting for Steve to tell us what he thinks is going on. And it looks like they left in a hurry. In a hurry, right. Let's see if we can get in there in a hurry and see if we can solve Ridgeview. Wonder if that's a nice little pictures there. So what's the name? Maria Jackson. I need to stay on, on that screen more. I read really quick it seems, but I can't really actually show you what's going on. So yeah, that's Maria Jackson. Right. Let's rock and roll. Come on. Come on, Spassmeister. Open the door. Press the button. Come on. You can do it. Stop talking. Stop talking. Press the button. There we go. Right. Let's get on in. It's a nice looking house, to be fair. I'd be quite happy with this house. So, this is where I kind of say its name, see if we can hear where it's coming from. And I hear a footstep over to the left. So, let's walk on over, check it out. See what we can find. Where are you, Maria? Give me a sign. What if this works okay with me doing a voiceover? Seems pretty quiet. Ooh, messing with the door. Hmm. I wonder if it's here. Okay. Yeah, I can still hear it playing with the door, so I'm gonna at least tell you it's in this room, so yeah, let's set up our usual stuff so the book. Pull it down and see if uh, we can uh, get this sorted. Let's double check. Make sure it isn't anywhere else, just in case it's a hallway one. Okay, so we know it's in that bathroom then. Uh, we'll go grab the other gear and hopefully you can spot and see what evidence we've got. Um, if you spot the evidence, that's great. If you don't, hopefully you get it before the end. Let's grab our UV and our spirit box like we usually do. So you won't hear me talk into the spirit box because of the uh, the voiceover that I'm doing. But it will you will hear the response because you can hear the audio in game fine if there is any. Um, so just uh, pay attention. This is episode two with Maria. Ooh, look at my eyes. Freaked me out a little bit. Maria Jackson is kind of being quite good to us in Ridgeview without uh, giving anything away of course 
So these are for these YouTube videos are for people who don't really have the game or just want to join in on a hunt when I'm doing it solo. Um, so this is just for extra content. And um, the first one was well received. This one was technically the first one, but I messed up the audio. So we'll yeah put that on properly. Don't press the wrong button. Um, we'll uh, keep these up for as long as people like. Um, if you do like it, if you can stick in below the comment as to what you thought it was and if you got it correct. And um, yeah, if you do obviously like it, press the like button. Let me know uh, people do like it out there, and I'll keep creating these for your fun. So let's uh, try and pop this uh, camera in here, see if we can get any whooshes. See if we can figure it out. Gotta switch that off for it to work. Likes messing with that door. Does like messing with that door. So, let's have a little look, see if we can see anything in here. See if we can figure out what it is. So obviously I can't give any clues away because you guys got to figure this out yourself. But I try and spend enough time in certain locations to allow you to pick up the evidence. Oh well. Cheeky wink. Aren't you all lucky? So let's get back on in here. Continue looking for that evidence. And if we manage to get all the evidence, we might get a little bit of a hunt in as well. Just because I normally do that. And it'll be good for you guys to experience it too in your own little way. That's getting much activity from her now. Ooh, that was a big step. Big step, Maria. What how bigger boots are? Size twelve boots. Ooh, a key. Let's see what other equipment we've got which we haven't used yet. Wanna make sure we get this one right. Ridge views being typically difficult. So annoying when it uh, doesn't give you the evidence straight away. But I guess if it gave it all of it, it would be difficult to do. So walk through salt. Let's go take our salt in there. And obviously grab the camera as well. May as well get the extra bonuses, eh? Extra money for me and you when we're doing our hunts. <laughs> Mess that up. Sounded like it was out here then. Weird. Ooh. Let's 
check down here, see if the breaker is all good. Oh, we just close the door then. Where's the breaker? Where you put the breaker, Maria? Ah, it's still on. Maybe we'll turn that off. Maybe we'll leave that off. Just to affect our sanity and some other reason I've done that. Got any ideas of what it is yet? So, in the words of one famous person, can you tell what it is yet? So technically, you should have all the clues you need now to know what kind of ghost we're dealing with. As well as a hint because I went down to the basement. So, let's go see if we can get it to hunt us. Let's see if we can get a photo of it. That's what we want now. Let's take a dual wielding camera. I'm sure I've got a second one equipped as well. Still messing. So now I'm just calling her out. Calling Maria. Be like, whoa. Slam that door in my face. She's got some nice pajamas on as per usual. Always look very clean pajamas it does in that model. And the power's still off. That was good. As soon as she was in the bathroom, she materialized right there. They tend to do that quite a bit. She really liked that lamp. I mean, just look at how she's staring at the camera. So like, ooh, I like this lamp. I wish I had that in my bathroom. Loved it. Ooh, she was close again. Where did she go? Where did she go? Maria. Maria. You're freaking me out, Maria. Oh. Gotta run. See, I can still talk to you guys now whilst we're being hunted, but I was pooping my pants. Let's see if we can hear how close she got. Maybe she was trying to communicate with Brick from Anchorman with that picture saying she likes lamp too. I like lamp. So you can actually leave your flashlight on during a hunt, um, it won't actually pick you up. It'll, it'll pick you up if you turn your flashlight on and off, because it'll hear that sound, but if you just leave it on, it won't notice it, because it doesn't notice the other lights flashing either, so a flashlight you'll be fine with. So just leave it on, you can see when it hunts then. So let's get out of here, we had our hunt, we know what it is. We got a photo because she materialized right next to the famous brick lamp. And we'll uh, get on out. Hoping that you've got the, uh, the ghost all booked in as well. Let me know in the comments below. Let me know if, you, uh, if your prediction was right too. Man, that is a good photo. Look at the quality of that. She loves that lamp. She wants that lamp. Maybe it's sponsored by her. That's cool. I like that photo. I wish I could, could, could have kept that one. Framed it. And she give you that option. Choose which photos you want to show on your wall. That'd be cool. Maybe I'll come in and update. Ooh, that's another pretty drawing. She's doing well. She is doing well. Well, Maria Jackson. You helped us out there. Made Ridgeview quite a pleasant experience, to be fair. So, 
Is it time to leave? We have got everything. Yeah, it looks like I'm gonna go. Let's have a little look, see if you got the same answer as me. Yep, it was a gin. Did you get that written down? I hope you did. Well, I'm pretty sure you did. You should have seen all the uh, evidence, including the whooshes, the EMF, and the spirit box we had right at the start. And the fact that I went downstairs into the basement and turned off that power. That was the reason I did that, because I figured out it was a gin before it actually triggered. Um, so, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this one. Obviously, it's a bit different because I'm doing a voice over here. I probably sound different as well, because it's not going through any equalizer. Um, so, if you did enjoy it, hit it up with a like, comment below as to what you thought. Um, and, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll continue making these if you enjoy them. Cheers, guys. Thanks. So guys, hope you enjoyed that. As I said, it was a bit of a hash one, so it's kind of version 1.5 rather than episode 2. Um, so if you did enjoy it, just let me know in the comments below. Let me know if you have figured it out. Hit it up with a like. And if you want to get involved, obviously, when we're live, follow me on Twitch. So yeah, hope you enjoyed it. Episode 2 will hopefully be along shortly. Um, I say shortly. It all depends when I get a chance to do it. Uh, quite busy over December, um, hence it's Christmas. Um, so yeah, enjoy it. Any questions, make sure you stick in the comments below. I'll always try and reply and just hit it up with a like. Cheers. Don't forget to subscribe. It means a lot. Helps the channel. Builds a community. Let's stick together, guys. <laughs> Speak to you soon.